Hey everybody, Sam back once again and today we are unboxing and taking a first look at this bad boy. Yes, the Nokia Lumia 920. So, let's check it out. So people, here we have it, the Lumi 920. So excited to get my hands on one of these ones. I want to say a big massive thank you to my people over at Nokia Connects for sending them to me for the review. So, let's shut up and let's get, uh, open it up and see what we get inside. So, yes, there we have it. I got the awesome red colour, which I'm going to call Ferrari red. I know that I know they won't be calling that legally, but it looks like a Ferrari red to me. So I was looking around the box. It's a very similar box to all the other Lumi devices in the past. And on the back, just gives you an indication of basically what option or what technology is inside the phone. So I know it's got a Windows Phone 8, Snapdragon, um, Snapdragon S4 dual core, the QI charger for wireless charging, the Pure View, the Pure Motion HD Plus display, Dolby Digital, and all that kind of good stuff. Anyway, we know what that is. Let's have a look at actual what you get inside the box. So there's the phone. First off the bat, without us taking the plastic off there, doesn't feel as heavy as everyone was saying it is. Feels pretty nice to me. Obviously there is the SIM card ejector ejector tool there. It's like yeah, I, I like that one. It's much it's a much better one that some fruit company gives you. So let's have a look what else we get inside here. I'm gonna get this just all this documentation and whatnot. So yeah, it's basically it's documentation. So if you want to read that kind of stuff, you can do me. No, not personally. You also get your three put yeah your three point five. I'm gonna say then your three pin plug adapter. Basic for the UK, whereabouts you are in the world, you get your own version as well, so don't worry about that. You get your micro USB for charging and sync cable, so obviously charge and sync that phone up. And something I think is pretty damn awesome, some red headphones. So I don't know, you know I've not seen many of the uh, headphones inside the boxes previously. A lot of the unboxings I've seen have been American ones, and obviously they don't seem to get headphones in America anymore. But yeah, how cool do they look? Anyway, that's it. Let's have a look at the actual device itself, because let's be honest, we're here to see that mainly, aren't we? So here it is. Let's just uh, take it out of its packaging. You always get that satisfying with you and taking the plastic off a device, don't you, for the first time. There we have it. The Lumia 920. I must say, uh, that, that gloss on there. I've not, I've got to say, I've not been a massive fan of glossy phones in the past. Um, but obviously after playing with the Lumi 920, I kind of come accustomed to it in all honesty with regards to the way that the design is of it, you know, it feels nice in the hand. So anyway, let's boot on for the first time this video as well. Actually, we'll show you around the device first. So on the bottom, you've got your micro USB for charging and syncing, as well as your speaker phones. You've got your dedicated camera button, it's always nice to see on a phone. The power shows lock switch, the volume up and down. On the top of the device, you've got your 3.5mm headphone jack. That is where your SIM card tray just goes in there, which I'll pop out in a moment to show you. Complete flush all the way down the side. On the front of the device, you have got, I believe, I believe it's a, it's almost a 720p camera. Uh, I'll put the actual full uh, description there for you. On the back, it's got the 8.9 megapixel PureView lens, which is their Carl Zeiss lens with a dual LED flash. Anyway, let's turn it on for the first time. And let's just see what this bad boy thing kind of looks like. Right, so I've booted on for the first time. I've gone through the initial setup procedure. So I just want to give you, you know, a really quick look at the actual phone itself and my first initial impressions after like five minutes. So as you can see, when it boots up, it obviously all goes into a nice kind of red colour. And I must say, looking off the bat, the screen itself it looks blooming lovely. It's absolutely fantastic in terms of you know, kind of clarity. And as you'd expect from Windows Phone, it is just super silky smooth. It, you know, there's not, I've not really known an operating system you know, that, that looks as cool as this, that's as silky as this on, on the, for the most part. Maybe 4.2 and Android's getting there, but seriously, it's just so smooth. So what we'll do is just have a quick look in the camera. So obviously we've got the dedicated camera button there, so we'll just tap the button. And up it loads. So I'll tell you what, we'll just uh, bring something in really quickly. So we'll use the headphones that we've just unboxed. As you can see, it's a little yellowish, but you can see the auto balance, so it does that again. The auto correction is pretty damn quick on it. So you can do two ways. Well, there's actually three ways of taking a picture. You can basically tap the screen, tap on the buttons, or tap the button at the top. So what I'll do is I'll just tap the button at the top and take the picture. Scroll it back in. And wow. That was pretty damn that looks pretty damn sharp, does that? I must say. 
Now obviously I'm going to be doing a full test on the actual camera itself, I'm not actually going to be doing this that one. We're doing low light ones, you know, as a proper good daylight ones, video tests, you name it. I'm going to put the camera to the test because there's one of the biggest selling features of this phone is the camera. What's having that pure, the pure view technology inside it. I'm also going to be testing a lot of the applications. So I'm going to be testing in regards to local scout, but a lot of the actual Nokia specific ones. So there we go. We've got like Nokia K, Nokia CityLens, Drive Maps, Music. I'm going to put all those to the test. I'm going to be doing a lot of individual videos as well as a big roundup video as well. So stay tuned for that. Do you have any questions with regards to the Lumi 920? If you do, not to do by now, hit me up down below. So again, don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Sam J Pullum. And yeah, you'll see me all in my next video. Cheers, everyone.